Let's go out with Cindy Lundeberg for the details. Cindy? Thanks, Nikki. Thanks, Jose. I'm here in Wolverine territory where the Longhorns are hungry for their first season win. Do the home team advantage keep the winning streak alive for Westview? Let's roll the highlights. Westview took the field for their homecoming game. We move ahead into second quarter action with Westview ahead 3-0 Wolverines. Gavin Battle airs one out to Taylor McNair who calls it in. Wolverines take a 10-zip lead. Still in the second, Daniel Kim busted up the middle for another Westview touchdown, making the score 17-0 Westview. Later in the second, Eric Beagle fakes the handoff and finds a wide-open Taylor McNair in the back of the end zone, making the score 24 nada Wolverine. Two minutes left in the half, Wolverines pouring it on. Eric Beagle hooks up with Taylor McNair again in the end zone, making the score 31-0, taking us into halftime. The Westview student section, the Black Hole, kept the Wolverine spirit alive during halftime. No score in the third takes us into the fourth where Westview kept dominating. J.P. DeGasparis takes the handoff, breaks it outside, and runs up the left sideline into the end zone. Final score, Westview 38, Rancho Buena Vista nothing. Rancho Buena Vista was just no match for Westview. Westview hopes to take this winning streak on next week to Del Norte. Jose Nicky, back to you guys at the studio. Thank you, Cindy.